So from the previous one, we had a 2 in here. I'm just going to erase the one that was the uh, non-reset on that one. So we'll have our uh, reset option there. I'm just going to go back to that one. So one more time just to make sure uh, that you understand it, so that once it gets completed, the reset platform, if it's enabled, is going to allow it to still continue to go through uh, what it did before. The reset on start and looping, if we turn this one on, um, it's going to actually go through, um, so we'll just show that one. On the on complete reset with fade in time, I'm going to set this one to zero, um, so there won't be any kind of fade or anything on that one. But the on complete reset and start looping, uh, actually this one might do it. We have the trigger sets for the player, so we'll see if the uh, we'll see if it picks it up with it. So we'll go to the end, and then once we go back up to the top, we'll see if it'll uh, start going through its loop or not. Yep, there it goes. So now it's just going to continue looping through, and then allowing it to kind of go through those stages. Oh, it'll actually loop down to the bottom stage. So once it goes back up, it'll have that auto going back down with it. Alright. So those are the different stages you can do for your reset, including the fade that we turned off that was fading uh, from the uh, previous one. Alright, so there's reset properties for those.